Hey guys, this is part two to the um, absorbent, the um, comparing store brands to um, proper brand period products. So, yeah, I've just got this cardboard thing so I can just lay the pads on so I will not um, like ruin like my carpet or anything. And I've got my little cup full. My syringe looks kind of gross at the moment, but with. Um, flavour, not flavoured, um, food colouring mixed in with water. So I'm going to start off and then I'll compare them together. I got a bit of food colouring on this while I um, was pouring it on. It's not like bad or anything. So just ignore that bit, that was my own fault. So yeah, I don't know how to place this so you could like see it. So it just looks like this in there. And first I'm going to get then I'll show you it after. This is 30 mils, so I'm just gonna like place it. Actually, I'll go like this just to try and show you if you know what I mean. Right, so it kind of like because the syringe it kind of splits out a bit, but it's not meant to be like that if you know what I mean. Oh, this is just a fail, it's going all over everything. I shouldn't have done this, but it's all over my camera. So, that was 35 mils, and it's kind of like, oh, sugar! Oh, bum, it's hole, it's gone on my carpet. I have to clear that up after, this happens all the time with solvency tests. Yep, so, this is. 35 mils. As you can see, it's very soaked up and it is soaked on the bottom, as you can see. And I've got a very messy room now. So, as you can see, all the stickiness is lost. And when you go like that, you can get like the liquid back up. So, let me see if I can like do this because sometimes people do this, they kind of like get the thing out. So yeah, that's kind of disgusting, but that's one mucky pad. So that takes 35 mils, and if you want to see what 35 mils looks like, I will get it up. Oh wait. This is what 35 mils looks like. It's quite a bit, to be honest. So, yeah. Let's just wrap this up back in its wrapper. Hopefully you won't be able to see any of this red stuff on the camera. Oh, this is disgusting. Let's put that straight in the bin. Ew. And then... So, it absorbs quite a lot. Um, and the Acti Pearls kind of like made it not smell bad, which is a good thing. So yeah, next I'm going to be doing is this super block one. Very thin compared to the other one. So yeah, and I've just dropped dropped a little splatters on, and like the always one, it dried really quickly, and so is this. So let's hope this one will be a bit more. It's been alright compared to the other one. So yeah, that's about five mils on already. And it's a little bit damp, I'll put it on the core bit, the outside I mean. It does absorb it, but it's a little bit wet, and I'm going to focus on like these holes. And as you can see, it goes in really quickly, so. As you can see it go on. So I'm just going to put all the 35 mils on it, just like I did on the other one, to make it a fair test. Because it wouldn't be very fair otherwise. And... These are actually quite absorbent, surprisingly, and they're just 49p from Superdrug, they're just the old towel ones, and it's kind of, 35 mils is more than a whole pad, so if you had a very heavy flavour, then these aren't very good. Alright, I don't know how to put this, but I'm going to have to show you like this. Can you see that? It's very messy. Not a very pretty sight. 
one I'm not going to... Right, how can I do this? That is what it looks like. Very messy. My hands are going to get... And it's... When you push it down, it comes straight up. As you can see, I'm going to try and like absorb it out. You could actually do that on this one, see? So I've got a lot of this left over. So, and on the back, it's completely push like thing. But this is more, the back is more dry than the always one was. But yeah, and as you can see, the absorbency core came out of it. So, yeah. And now I'm going to do part three. Um, and then I'm going to cut this one up and show what's inside it. And I'll show you the other one. It's not completely in there, but it's just on the very top. And I'll wash my hands after. So, yeah. So I will show you what's in them um, after. So, yeah, this is a very muffy pad. So, for part one, which was like packaging and looks and stuff. Um call it a draw. Round two, which was this bit. For dryness, I'm going to say this because it is more dry on the bottom, like it hasn't leaked through the bottom like the Always One did. It's like on the Always One it made this and that, but on that one it stayed dry, but it's very like a damp feel on the top. So yeah, now I am going to do part three, which is cutting like them up and just show you what is inside them so yeah bye and subscribe and i hope you like this video and if you'd like me to do more like round things like round one part two and whatever just comment below and give me some like ones i should do and i will think about them and i probably will do them so now i'm just going to do a bit of a clear up before i do part three so yeah bye